Hey, it's Jonathan here, and I want to show you exactly what the whole road test situation is all about. If you're looking to get a CDL license, you are going to have to get yourself past a CDL road test. Now, the road test, as you already read on this page, is over two and a half hours long. But one of the benefits of being a student here at Driving Academy is you have access to take the test at our own third-party testing site. That's right. You don't have to go to any DMV, and we can accept you no matter what state you're coming from. The way the process works is we have our own third-party testing site located in Levittown, Pennsylvania, and you're going to take the test there just like normal. So you're going to need your driver's license, your permit, and everything like that. Our, our own staff members are going to be the ones giving you the actual CDL road test. And once you pass, we'll update it to the national database. You go back to your home state, and within seven days, you can actually pick up your CDL license just like you went and took your test at a normal DMV. The cool thing about us is we are normal people. Most of our examiners were instructors in the past, so they know exactly what you went through during your training itself. So we try to make it as much as a comfortable environment as you need to. But let's show you exactly what the road test is all about. So check out this quick video. Step three of getting your CDL includes passing a CDL road test. Now you must be aware in 2015, the road test did change from a half hour long test to a two and a half hour long test, making it much more difficult to pass. The first part of the CDL road test includes an air brake and pre-trip inspection. This will test your skills on how you can inspect the inside and outside of the vehicle. You can either fail or you can pass. If you do fail, you're disappearing and you're going home. If you pass, you get to move on to the next step. The next step of this test is all about yard skills. This is able to test your skills on how you can maneuver the vehicle in a parking situation. You will follow the course as shown, go around the course. The first skill is going to be straight line backing, then offset backing, followed by parallel parking. From there, they're going to ask you to do an alley dock, but only if you're lucky. There are only two options from here. You either did well or not so well. If you failed, you might look like that guy. If you passed, you might be happy. But wait, it's not over yet. The next step is going to be your road skills. This is where they're going to take you out onto the road and test your skills on highway driving and shifting. Now don't forget, this is the easiest part of the test. So if you do everything that that video just talked about, then you pass your test and now it's time to get your CDL license. So within 10 days, you're ready to rock and roll and start yourself on your road to freedom. And then when you're a student here, you actually get enrolled into our lifetime job placement program. So if you're interested in learning more, click on the link on this page, fill out the form, and one of our team members will definitely be giving you a call shortly. Thanks, and hope to see you on the road to freedom pretty soon. Have a good day. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you hit that like button. Also, subscribe to our channel. It's really going to help us out. Click on that button. And if you want to continue yourself on your road to freedom, here's more videos to watch. There's endless amounts. Hopefully we get to see each other one day very soon. Thanks.